Hi guys. Well, I was looking through another section of my collection and came up with more 80s CDs. So, here we go. Alright, continuing on the 80s tip, we have Peter Gabriel. So, A great one, Thomas Dolby, Aliens Ate My Buick. Trying to uh, remember which uh, song uh, was popular in the day. I believe... Um, there are a few of them that were uh, good on here. I think, um, there were a few on here that I liked. The key to for her Ferrari. Um, my brain is like a sieve. A bit. Oh, I think if my memory serves me correctly, May the cube be with you. Was he uh, was most well known on here? Okay, this, in my opinion, is not was not only a cool movie but also a cool soundtrack. Um, a lot of people don't like the movie, but me being a early uh, you two diehard fan, I liked it. I just like the way they, um, I, I like both the movie and the, uh, the soundtrack. Of course, I'm, I'm, I'm a diehard U2 fan. I have this on VHS. Can you believe it? <laughs> VHS. Talking Heads. Another cool. Uh, um, uh, this is Stop Making Sense. This is a uh, cool record. Or CD, album, whatever you want to call it. And here we have REM document. I believe the um, the popular one off here was a uh, finest work song. Yeah, I believe it. Finest work song. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> and the one I was was also uh, pretty popular. This one goes out to the one I love. Ah, uh, yes. The, um, the Pet Shop Boys. This was like a, um, The Grace Hits discography. Yep. All right, last one for now. Party on Grease Rock Hits of the 80s. What I like about you, you may not be able to see this. What I like about you, the Romantics, moving on over, George Thurgood and the Destroyers, Mercury Blues by David Lindsay, Everybody Wants You by Billy Squire. Um, Rockless Town by the Stray Cats, Centerfield by the J. Galsbane, 
Wake Me Up Before You Go Go by Wham and California Girls by David Lee Roth. Alright guys, well that's it for me. I hope you all are having a great Friday and uh, I may be back tomorrow uh, weather permitting with a bike ride video so please uh, stay tuned for that and uh, please um, you know comment subscribe like whatever you uh, feel and uh, I hope everybody has a fabulous Friday and I will be back soon until then peace Love and keep the good tunes spinning. Thank you. Take care. Hey guys, it's Trish. Thought I'd give you a little um, update on uh, Liz happenings. Well, uh, before this video, I um, I did add a response to uh, Adam's um, top twenty. Uh, 80 songs I probably did o over 20 but those were like the um so the CDs were you know I look around and I I found some uh, and I like oh this is a good song I have to go so I'm I'm sure I went over 20 but it's all about having fun with it right <clears throat> and yesterday um, you may have seen uh, the video about um, Frank retiring. Um, it was kind of a melancholy thing. Like, I'm glad after 30 years he's able to just, you know, spend more time with his wife and his kids. And, well, his son, his uh, one son's local and... Uh, he just bought a house, so he, Frank's helping him with that. But now he gets to just do things on his own time and not worry about, you know, doing overtime at work and stuff like that. And he can just relax and enjoy things and, you know, travel and go places and, like I said, spend more time with his wife. And I wish him the best. I'm gonna, I'm gonna miss him. I mean, today I definitely missed him. I miss that sense of humor. I miss, you know, everything. But um, his substitute, um, Michelle, she's very nice. Um, that no one will replace me. No one. And uh, but um, we we. We swore we'd keep in touch. Even Kathy, uh, the lunch lady, said, you know, we. she said she'd made a promise we'd keep in touch. All right, getting ready to hit the shower and uh, thumb gate go to bed. And hopefully, weather permitting, tomorrow we'll get in a little bike ride video. All right, see you then.